Hey YouTubers, this is Gary One with another video here. Uh, this is going to be the first in a series of uh, short video tutorials on how to use the Easy GUI library. Easy GUI is a, an, an easy to use uh, library for Python. It works with both Python 2 and 3 and is cross-platform to help you generate simple uh, file or uh, graphical dialogues uh, using tkinter. Uh, I recommend using some other kind of development environment besides idle because idle is also tkinter and uh, it could interfere with it if you're if you're trying to run it and run an easy GUI program at the same time they do have a pretty easy to use tutorial here that goes over all of their dialogues and I'm just gonna make uh, a series of, of quick videos talking about each one uh, so the first one we're gonna talk about is just message box all right, we're going to say bring open genie here. And now for those of you who don't know, that first line uh helps Linux users because when you run this file on Linux, you don't have to specify Python 3 to run it with. You can just run it like a normal executable and your computer will know that it to use Python 3 to execute it. Alright, so we're going to say from Easy GUI import star. Easy GUI is available in the Ubuntu uh, package managers. It's where I got it from. Or you could download the file itself from their website to kind of package with your software if you're distributing it so that you don't have to worry about telling the end users, oh, by the way, you've got to go download this thing before the program will work. Uh, so I usually do from Easy GUI import all instead of just import easy GUI and that way you don't have to say easy GUI dot message box blah 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 uh, so this video is going to be about the message box we're just going to say message box parenthesis the first argument is always going to be your your uh, your displayed text uh, unless you organize it a different way so it could be message equals or if you just leave it blank and start typing a string it will assume that that string is going to be the value of the message variable so we're going to say message this is a message dialog box All right. now you also have a title argument that's going to say uh, it's going to specify the text of your title bar uh, like this up here so we're going to say title we're going to say title equals this is a sample title. All right, and then we're going to go down here to our little built-in terminal, and we're going to dot slash. Well, let's make sure it's executable first. And this is an Easy GUI message box. All right, now like with all of the other Easy GUI products, you can set these variables equal to. Uh, uh, you can set these variables equal to other variables so let's say this is a message box that's repeated a lot for whatever reason uh, you don't have to put the strings here you can say that uh, let's say version let's say you wanted all of the, t the title bars on all of your dialogues just to be the program version we can say tutorial version 1.0 all right end quote and then we can just say title is equal to version and then here when we run it you can see that it replaces the title bar text up there so uh, that's the basic gist of message box uh, if you guys have any comments questions or concerns or suggestions post them below I'm gonna try to record a series of videos on this easy GUI library talking about some of uh, its more useful features uh, this is Gary one out y'all have a good one